My 600 pound life shares some of the most transformative stories on television, but some episodes are better than others. The series, which typically shows the life of each patient over the course of a year, has told the stories of some incredibly interesting cast members. While it can be frustrating to watch at times, the program is honest, providing real portrayals of people who are trying to lose significant amounts of weight. It shines a light on the most authentic aspects of their experiences. While some My 600 Pound Life stars are more memorable than others, the stories that tend to leave an impression on viewers are either deeply moving or unusual. The show doesn't mock its participants, including Mark Rutland, which is good, as these cast members already get flack. Instead, it shows the most intriguing parts of the weight loss process, giving viewers insight into the minds of the patients. These reality stars are doing their best to make major changes in their lives. Seven fascinating My 600 Pound Life episodes have aired, according to Redditors. Seven My 600 LB Life Season 9 Samantha Mason Samantha originally weighed in at nearly 1,000 pounds. While she was aware of the issues she had with food, she had based her career around it. As an online personality who was paid to eat on camera, her livelihood threatened her health. Samantha knew that she needed to lose weight quickly, or her daughter might be left without a mother. Fans like you, July 106 found Samantha's story to be the only redeeming season 9 episode. That's because she was honest and open about the process of slimming down. She was faced with a dilemma, as shedding pounds caused her to lose business. 6 My 600 LB Life Season 5's James King James, who started out his journey at nearly 800 pounds, did not have a happy ending to his story. While he worked hard to overcome his struggles, he wound up gaining weight after his appearance on My 600 Pound Life. He was close to 850 pounds before beginning to slim down. He lost over 300 pounds, but unfortunately, his prior weight gain had damaged his body. He sadly passed away in 2020, after complications from kidney failure. It was easy to root for James, who had six children with his partner Lisa, while watching his episode. It was heartbreaking when he died. 5 My 600 LB Life Season 7's Justin McSwain Justin was an inspiration on My 600 Pound Life, beginning his journey at nearly 700 pounds. He was struggling when he first met with Dr. Now, but the surgeon chose to take a chance with his newest patient, which really paid off. Justin lost over half his body weight after bariatric surgery, and has continued to maintain his healthy weight. With frequent updates on social media, Justin is a true My 600 Pound Life success story, and fans have found him to be an inspiration in their own lives. Reddit user U, Zombie explained that Justin is an absolutely amazing individual who is owning it. For My 600 Pound Life Season 5's Brandy Candy Dryer Brandy and Candy, who opened My 600 Pound Life Season 5, had a combined weight of 1,100 pounds when their body makeover journeys began. The twins decided to make changes together as they were 29 years old, and afraid they wouldn't make it to 30. They were concerned that one of them would pass away, and the other would be alone. After a very serious health scare, when Candy's blood pressure dropped after her weight loss surgery, the pair ultimately took control of their health. Both of them dropped hundreds of pounds. The relationship between the sisters, and their drive to better themselves, was inspiring.
3 my 600 pound life season 9's Isaac Martinez Isaac weighed in at over 650 pounds when viewers met him on my 600 pound life season 9. The Texas native had been dealt a very difficult hand as a child, dealing with his mother's illness and caring for his family from a young age. When Isaac finally started dealing with health issues of his own due to his weight, he decided to make positive changes. On screen, Isaac was very close to getting weight loss surgery, but after his episode, there was scant information about him. The mystery of Isaac has intrigued viewers like you, Benny's Tiny Dancer, who said, I really want to follow up on him. To my 600 LB Life Season 5 Stephen Asante fans on Reddit found Stephen Asante, who was on my 600 pound Life Season 5 with his brother Justin, to be one of the most fascinating cast members from the series. Stephen knew his health was at great risk, as he weighed in at almost 800 pounds. Even though he knew how poor his health was, and that it would continue to get worse if he didn't change his ways, Stephen was ultimately unable to control himself. After undergoing weight loss surgery with his brother Justin, Stephen lost over 300 pounds. Still, his behavior seemed strange while he recovered from surgery, and adapted to his new and healthier life. Stephen was eventually kicked out of the hospital for substance abuse, and verbally abusing staff members. His behavior was erratic, and fans took notice of his strange and unruly attitude. He and his brother are no longer on speaking terms, but Justin did confirm that Stephen is alive. His death was falsely reported in February 2023. 1 My 600 LB Life Season 2's Christina Phillips Christina Phillips, who appeared on My 600 Pound Life Season 2, is one of the most inspiring success stories to ever appear on the show. Christina is likable because, even though the odds were stacked against her at nearly 700 pounds, she was determined to lose the weight. She lacked support from her family and friends, including her husband, Zach, whom she eventually separated from. Though Christina remains somewhat private on social media, she's gone on to become a whole new version of herself. She's competing in 5k races, and raising a family. She slimmed down to 185 pounds, and the My 600 Pound Life celebrity is a great role model. Sources. You, Ow, Reddit, Uper Millimeter 6M, Reddit.